All right, John, a uh, big win to keep you guys in the mix in this tournament. But on a personal note, this is not the role that you've been used to, you know, coming on the bench, off the bench, mm -hmm. uh, low minutes, and on top of that, having troubles uh, with injuries. Yeah. Give, me, give me a little walkthrough on, on this uh, difficult season for you. Uh, well, I mean, my, my role is a little different mm -hmm. uh, here right now. You know, I'm 36. Uh, I know my role coming here. Um, you know, it's been touring the young guys, being a veteran um, in big games, and uh, it's not to play 35, 30 minutes. You know, um, other than that, right now I'm healthy. Uh, I feel good, and uh, this is, I guess, different for fans seeing me, you know, in a different role now. But you know, that's where it's at right now uh, in my career with this team, uh, and it's a good team, good young team that uh, we're doing special things, so. Germany so far, uh, what's the level like of this um, Bundesliga league? Yeah, um, it's okay. Uh, you know, it's, it's a good level. Uh, the Champions League is a really good league. Um, and uh, it's okay. Uh, and a different experience for me and my family also uh, away from basketball, just in life uh, in Germany. So, but I like it. Uh, the Venezuelan national team, John. Mm -hmm. It was difficult to bring you guys over, you know, the uh, guys playing overseas uh, mm -hmm. to join the, the, the national team for the FIBA windows, but are you expecting a call-up for the February uh, window? Uh, I'm not sure, but I mean, it's it would be even difficult for me to play. We have a game on the 18th, I think, and our first game is the 22nd. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I, I don't know. Um, you know, I haven't talked to um, anybody about that yet, but um, this is really hard being here. And you only have three days after your last game to go and play um, in the qualifiers. So uh, it's just difficult for me and Gregory, actually. Uh, to wrap this up, uh, you went on a difficult note with uh, Bucaneros mm -hmm. heading off to the LPB. What can you tell me about it? There's talks that uh, the management has debts with mm -hmm. you and your contract. What can you say about it? Well, yeah, I, I didn't get, when, you know, when I was there, I just didn't get paid. So, um, you know, my agent, an agency went through, you know, FIBA, which is normal, uh, when you don't get your, you know, don't get your money. Um, you know, I was there three months, I tried to wait, but you know, for three months I didn't get paid, so I had to go and, you know, take another job and, uh, you know, right now that's the situation. <laughs> you know, I hope I still get paid for what I did. Um, but uh, right now, it's just you know, it's just with FIBA, and it was just unfortunate. It's tough working. You, you know, you don't get your money. So, is the agency suing the team right now on the uh, court? Oh uh, yeah, that's been done. I mean, okay. that's, that's you know, with the bad case and, and through FIBA now. You know, they, they filed it already, and um, you know, that's where it is. Besides this, um, are you planning on a return in the near future to Venezuela, or is that a chapter that ended well? Um, well it didn't. But right now it's not good, right? Because I, I was playing and you know I did I didn't get paid. Um, if it ends well, then that's you know that's different. Uh, you're talking the future when I, I still didn't didn't get paid for it. what I did it you know in the past in my previous contract. But um, you know if things get better and the case ends well. Um, then yeah, why not?